Overrunning alternator pulleys are becoming increasingly popular on many modern passenger cars and light commercial vehicles due to increased alternator loads. As opposed to traditional solid pulleys, they allow the alternator to freewheel or overrun every time the engine decelerates and at the same time dampen vibrations at the alternator. When it's working correctly, the pulley transmits drive in one direction and slips or freewheels in the other direction. When the pulley's clutch mechanism has failed, it usually locks up solid in both directions, which puts a terrific strain on the drive belt and tensioners. We will demonstrate removing the pulley on a Bosch alternator. The Laser 7052 kit also includes tools for removing pulleys on Denso, Valio and Morelli alternators. First, release the serpentine belt. Then remove the dust cover from the front of the pulley. Now we can clearly see how the pulley is secured to the alternator and that we need a combination of two separate tools to locate and grip both the inner and outer splines. In this case we use the M10 driver for the inner alternator spline, the half inch drive 10 mm bit holder and the 33 point spline driver for the outer pulley spline. The 33 point spline driver is gripped by the 15 mm spanner included in the kit. The M10 driver holds the alternator spindle steady as the 33 point spline driver turns the pulley. Always check the alternator rotation to ascertain which way to release the pulley. In this example, it's a left hand thread. Fitting the new pulley is the same procedure in reverse, and just a few seconds work. The pulley now grips correctly in the direction of alternator rotation, and overruns in the opposite direction. This comprehensive alternator pulley toolkit is available now from your Laser Tools stockist.